when you start drinking in the morning. Side healthy and like fuck if he was crying, looking in the mirror and feeling mm -hmm. like shit, and he was addicted to drugs mm -hmm. and. And, and, and he came from a healthy background, and he came from a background where he was making a documentary about health. When it got really bad, um, I, you know, when you, when you start drinking in the morning, it's really bad. Yeah. And uh, alcohol became the worst part of it, worse than, worse than even, you know, the pills. And I just remember uh, <clears throat> they start selling alcohol in L.A. at 6 a.m. And I remember I used to live right across from Gold's Gym in Venice. And I'd get up, and I'd walk across the street at, like, you know, 545 uh, because my car was parked. I had to park across the street right by the gym. I'd walk across the street over by the gym, and I'd see my friends going into the gym for a workout, and they'd be like, hey, Chris, what's going on? You know, I'd be waving them. I'd be going to the liquor store. Wow. And that's when I knew it was, like, really bad and things needed to change. So, you know, I, I really do think that, like you said, um, it takes somebody just, like, that little thing. So if there's people out there that are listening to this, just uh, hit me up or hit up somebody and tell them that you're hurting because people will help you. You need other people. You're not yeah. going to do it on your own. Uh, everybody needs other people, period. That's, this idea of the lone wolf <laughs> is total horseshit. I need to help other people yeah. in order for me to be fulfilled. For sure. You yeah, know, man. So. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we're all, we're all together in this thing.